now we have results back on that instance we created a little while ago. <clears throat> so under HostScan, we have that instance with its name. The highest risk level is critical. Typically, your CVS uh, score um, will be 0 to 10. So the top, like 8, 9, and 10, will be critical. Below that would be high, the medium, low, and of course none for things that are just barely noticeable. We found 110 issues. So the operating system is Linux, and we just did the scan. Now if I click on the host name, I can get more specifics about that host. Fully qualified domain name will show up here if there is one. Uh, <clears throat> what the DNS host name is known as. Again, the risk level, how many issues, how many open ports, and when this last time we scanned was. Simple bar chart showing the different counts. Later on, there will be a <clears throat> another graph here showing trending. So I have one VNIC on that box with 10 ports open. This will show us the ports, protocol, and what the typical service is. And then what IP address it could be associated with. Internal to OCI or external. Then I can see a list of the vulnerabilities on this box. It will be sorted when we go GA, critical, then high, medium, etc. So if I want to go drill down into one of these critical CVEs, I'll just click on it. It will show me if there's a, if there's a number of hosts. It will show up here in a list. This link here will pop me over to NVD website and I can learn more about specifically what module who's causing this to be a CVE. I can see the specific CVSS score right there. Also the references and typically where it's going to be, where it's going to be located. Okay. Once I patch this, this, this uh, CVE will disappear from this host and it will be Obviously, the score of this host then will get better. So I go back to details. I also had a section on CSI benchmark. At GA, we're going to cover things that deal with authentication and access, so a lot of SSH, etc. It's past this, and it's failed many other ones, past that one as well. These are typical things that you'll do with CIS to ensure that your system is hardened so that people can't easily get access and take over your box.